everyone's always talking about, you know, relationship goals, relationship goals, and all the things that they hope to attain while in a relationship. And something that I've noticed about this is that they're usually very materialistic. They have to do, you know, nice cars, matching sneakers, things like that. How about we focus on some attainable relationship goals, and then from there we grow. For example, an attainable relationship goal, you know, job hunting together. Making sure that y'all are both making at least $14, $15, $16 dollars an hour. Making sure that you guys are studying together, going to school together, getting education, trying to do more. Making sure that the other person is not in debt, running their cards up and things like that. I mean, these are all attainable relationship goals. Things that make perfect sense. You, It seems a lot of times that people just want almost sugar daddies or sugar mamas or something. Like, you're just supposed to get the best guy, the best girl out there. Like, no, you can get the best, but it's it's like you want the richest. You're going more for what they can give you physically rather than emotionally and things like that. And then you grow with this person. I'm not saying that you should, you know, have to build a man or anything like that. But if he has all, everything that he needs to be a great guy and his checks don't match that, and, you know, your relationship goal is to drive a Ferrari, like, come on. Do you have a Ferrari? I'm just saying. Can you get a Ferrari by yourself? Probably not. So you guys need to work on how are we going to get one together? How are we going to build together? How are we going to come up together? It should, you guys should be equally yoked. You should be moving together up, 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 up. If you get a guy that's up here and you're here in your life, what do you have to offer that guy? Nothing except for cookies. I'm just saying. So just think about these things. When Next time you think about relationship goals and what you want, think about who you can get it from, who you can work on it with, who you can tag in. When you are looking for a relationship, you should be looking for a partner. Literally, somebody you can tag in, like, man, I'm down and out right now, tag him in. And he just carries it and works it out. And you guys work it out together. So, you know, think about these things. Same thing for gentlemen. Think about these things. You go for the girl with the biggest butt, but the girl whose face is in a book is probably the one you need to, you know, get and treat right. Don't just get her and then run around with all these other girls. No, that's not how it goes. You get her, you treat her right, you know, take her to the store, update her swag if that's the case because her face has been in her book this whole time, whatever. If that's going to, you know, help, but then you grow with her. I'm just saying, something to think about.